Hi guys, we are going to be making leaf lanterns, which was part of a challenge um, on Kayla's Get Outdoors for Girl Scouts. And so we collected leaves on our hike and then we went to the Dollar Tree and bought some stuff. I'm gonna show you. So we bought, excuse my dog in the background, he's nuts. We bought these glass jars for a buck 25. Thought they were a pretty good size and then we bought Two of these Mod Podges, and these are the leaves that we're gonna use. Kayla right now is working on cutting off the stems. And so yeah, we're gonna show you the process and hopefully, hopefully we do this right. You don't really have to cut off much on them. Like it was showing in the video that you should like, kind of like, you know, obviously we can't cut out all this stuff, so. We'll see how well we do. At least we're trying. And we're doing it together, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh my goodness, you don't even have that much. I know, because I'm not going to like bombard mine with it, I think. I want mine too. So, what you do is, so let's put some of this stuff on our plate. On my plate too? Yeah, put it on your plate. Squeeze some of the stuff I, like, in there. Yep, you move wherever you want it. I feel like it's much easier to. So then, yep, just squirt it on there. Is it not a lot? <laughs> Here's bubbles. Why am I gonna shake it? Yep. It's much more better shaking it. Oh, that's good. Okay. So then what you're going to do is you're going to figure out which leaf you want to put down first. And then you're going to put the Mod Podge the size of it. You know what I mean? So like you're going to like spread it all like that. So it fits it. Can I do tiny You do whatever you want to do. How do you know it's going to be this right size? I don't know. I'm just doing it. I'm just making sure. Remember, it dries clear, right? So this, it doesn't really matter. Oh. And then it said to let it like dry a little bit before you apply the leaf. So it gets like sticky and tacky. Mm -hmm. I think I need to add a little more on this They were saying to use like fake leaves because these leaves like don't stick very well. Okay. I don't know. Might have to put like maybe a little bit underneath. Like and because then you're supposed to put the hodgepodge on top of it as well. Oh, that's smart. So I think anything that doesn't stick, you're going to be scraping it over anyways. But I think you do that. Yeah, this one's not working at all. I'll just try this way then. And it's also okay if you get a little more <laughs> Our fingers are just going to get super sticky. <laughs> I guess so. It's kind of hard to work with. I'm not going to lie. We're trying, right? Yeah. Plus, we've never done this ever. I, I, I don't think I've ever done this before. Really? No. I mean, maybe I did some of this stuff when I was a kid. I don't know. So, this is not working as easily as we thought it was going to work. It just will not stick. Oi. So, we're doing the best we can, and hopefully, um, yeah. It'll just be imperfect. It's okay. All right, guys, last night I put Mod Podge on Mod Podge on all these to kind of seal them. So it's going to be about as good as it gets. I'm going to light them up tonight when we have trick or treaters with or coming over to the house. So I'll show you when they're illuminated. Hey guys, I wanted to show you quickly my new spread for the current week, what we're on. Um, this is 
it's actually kind of using a bunch of shops. Um, the main thing, <laughs> these boxes and stuff, these are all from Planner Envy, and so is the the washi. I really don't know where the weekend banners from. These headers are from Plan to Plan, and I think so are the date headers as well. I think these silver guys, I think, are from, let's see, I think I have one of the sheets out somewhere. Yeah, they're from Letters to Apollo. Um, these spider webs are from Plan to Plan. I think this one's from, it's a, from a leftover kit. I think it's from Lemon and Honey Studio. Because I save all of my extra stickers that I have. I do not throw many of them away because you can use them, you know, when you don't have full kits. And so that's what I did. And um, these colorful boxes like this one here and this one here, those are from Plan to Plan as well. So yeah, I just wanted to show you quickly. And then obviously, I'll by the end of the week, I will fill everything in. It's been a pretty low-key week so far. But like, you know, it is payday. So and then we got, you know, some activities on the weekend that we're doing. So anyways, let it quickly show you. Talk to you guys later. Bye. Laundry away. Mm. Let's get moving. I will never smile for you, smile for you, smile for you, smile for you. I will never cry for you, cry for you, cry for you, cry for you. I can take this anymore. You say we're done, but you still want more. Baby, what I need is you out the door. This time, I'm sure. Yeah. That you're a bad boy, up to no good. Trying to be a man, but you're stuck in boyhood. Baby, you won't ever treat me the way you should. So it's over for good. I will never smile for you, smile for you, smile for you, smile for you. Just in case you're wondering what this bag of clothes is, it's ready to be donated. Mostly Kayla's, um, some of mine and Zach's, but I'm going to take it to Goodwill soon. I honestly think I'm just gonna go for like an air purifier soon because this is kind of ridiculous all this dust flying around in this closet is my just towels and um, nail polish that we barely use um, there's like a caddy down below that we have like our first aid kits and um, we do have sh you know shelves for each of us the, the boys have the top I have the one underneath that um, the one below that is Caitlin's and then the one below that is Kayla's also with our hand towels and our washcloths but um, I mean it does the job I wish it was bigger um, maybe even maybe one shelf taller or below but you know it serves its purpose 
Can you guess what I'm gonna do here in a second, guys? Take a guess. What can I be doing? Hmm, even though I'm taking a while to go do what I need to do. I'm coming, here I am. What am I doing? Oh my gosh, do you know how cool it is to have a laundry chute, guys? I love these things so much and it's, it's just fun. Who has one? I wanna know, do you have a laundry chute at your home? Hey guys, it is Saturday, beautiful 67. I think the weather's confused because normally by this time we're a lot colder. Um, Kayla and I back there, she's eating some gummy bears. We went to two trunk or treats today. One was um, in the downtown area where we live and I bought some Scentsy stuff. It was like a vendor event and then the kids could dress up and get candy and one of her best friends was there. And then we went to a trunk or treat at her school. There was like a haunted hallway, games, and um, there were, you know, trunks decorated. So she got candy. And then we just were at Salvation Army. You can kind of see in the background there. We got some clothes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna haul that as soon as we get home. And I'm just wanted to, hope, bleh, I wanted to tell you guys, I hope you guys are having a good weekend. Um, and I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey guys, I'm back from Salvation Army. I'm going to show you what I got. So I got these Flair pants for my for my Miss Kayla. And we started getting like Christmas shirts. So she got this one that's like from Old Navy. Got this purple oversized sweater. And this one says Meowy Christmas. It reminded us of our white kitty Luna. And then we found this sweater. And I got this blanket, this Christmas blanket, because we're already all thinking about, well, I'm thinking about Christmas. And I got this snowman that I accidentally forgot that was in the blanket. And I knocked and he fell over. So I have to crazy glue his his skis back on but it shouldn't be a problem and I did go to Valley but I put that stuff away already sadly um my ankle's really bad and I need to eat lunch and I need to nap I'm so tired so um I just wanted to show you quickly what I got Salvation Army um yeah I'll talk to you guys later bye as always thanks for watching guys please hit a like before you leave subscribe if you're not Stay tuned for my next video, which will be Halloween themed. Bye, guys.